I am Anil Kumar sharing with you a test question on factoring trinomials. Now the question here is we need to really find the missing coefficients. We are given 12x square minus 7x plus a equals to 3x minus b times 4x minus b. So you need to find what is the value of a and what is the value of b. That is a very good question. I like you to pause the video answer and then look into my suggestions. I have two different ways of solving it, right? One way is that you could actually expand the right side and then compare the coefficients and write down the answer. So that is one way of doing it. Of course, we can do it like that also. So we will expand also and then do it, which is kind of like this. When you expand it, you get 3x times 4x, which is 12. So you get 12x squared. Now 3x times minus b. So we get minus 3bx and now we will multiply with minus b. So when you multiply by minus b you get minus 4bx and then minus b times minus b gives you plus b squared. Now we can combine these two terms. When you combine these two terms you get 12x squared minus 3 and 4 is 7. So we get 7bx plus b squared, right? Now, equation given to us is 12x squared minus 7x plus a. And what we get here is 12x squared minus 7bx. So if you compare, what do you get? So 7b, so that is the coefficient of x, right? So that is to say, by comparison, we say 7 should be, or you can say minus 7 equals to minus 7b. Now that means the value of b is 1. Now if value of b is 1, I'll get 1 square here, right? So substitute b as 1 here. So when you do that, what do you get? You get here as 12 x square minus 7 x plus 1, right? Now when you compare, you get a as 1, right? So you get a as 1. And therefore, your answer is a equals to 1 and b equals to also 1, right? So that becomes your answer. So that is how you can actually expand and easily find the answer. The other way is, uh, you know your techniques. This term here is product of the, I mean, a should be equals to minus b times minus b, right? So from the knowledge, what you can do is, you could also do this, this is an alternate method, right? So A is basically equals to minus B times minus B, O which is indeed B square. So you get one equation. And this minus 7x, you know, is actually addition of the terms which are 3x times b and b test. So addition of these two should be equals to minus 7x. So which is minus 3bx and when you multiply these two, so means inner terms and outer terms, you get minus 4b I should return, 4bx. So what do you get here? You get minus 7bx and comparing you get b equals to 1 and then substituting b back here you get a equals to 1. That is when you substitute this value of b here, right? So you get a equals to 1. Right? So you, you could adopt either way to solve such questions, right? So that is fairly straightforward. So I'll prefer this method. Just expand, simplify, compare the coefficients and get your answer. I hope that helps. Thank you and all the best.